in a context. So let's so context is the way Zap identifies uh, what to scan and how to scan. So here, this is our domain, right? So is there anything we want to exclude? Uh, I don't think so. So let's go into the authentication. First thing you want to change here is select form based authentication and you need to uh, load the login form you need to tell uh, zap like what's the login url here so i'm going to select this one which is do login which we just saw right here you need to say user id and then password is password and then uh, one thing i guess it's going to be very helpful if you put this regex pattern used to identify logged out messages right so uh, what you can do here is the other best way to verify if there was any vulnerability which was identified in the post authenticated pages and then obviously uh, the 